we go out to the middle of this land, and in the middle, there's this dead cow. No blood. No blood. Scattered stories of carved up livestock and strange lights in the sky date back to the 1890s in the U.S., but it wasn't until the early 1970s that a pattern began to emerge. A mutilation explosion rocked Midwestern, then Western states. Then, as now, the main targets were cows, although horses, deer, pigs, goats, and other animals have received similar treatment. Today, nearly 15,000 mutilation reports have been received. Most often, the phantom surgeons remove sex organs, udders, rectums, eyes, or ears. The carcasses are usually drained of blood, but blood is rarely found on the ground. 